Chobel, Chobel, Honorable Alex Kajari, MP from Kajari. Honorable Alex Kajari, the vice president. Chobel, with a bad weather, for good weather, on the other hand, Chama Tokatu, Chama Pufayas, Chama Lera Tankatu, Nako Richard Chama, Chama, Nako, Nako,
the Northern Regional Minister, the Ministers of State, the Member of Parliament, MMTC, my hardworking Northern Regional Executives, Constituency Chairman, Constituency Executives, Electoral Area Coordinators, Police Station Executives, all party supporters. I cannot forget Unkutam, the party security. Shama Ali, Unkur Sokam Sokam, Zumota Surmo, the Yelab Das of Kanli, Unti, Northern Region Numa. The first time for Captain Modena, Lange. The flag bearer of the new Pazoti party. Dracha Pimu Pimu, 4th of November. The Nauri Nazareti, His Excellency Dr. Mahmoud Bahumia, is now our flag bearer. Come on, 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 come you want me to break the eight? Break the eight, mommy. She has to come to pass for you. You don't want to die in a book, you want to man. You want to die in a book. You're not going to be good now. But you're not going to be good now. 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 You're not so, Pompomo, this is a one camp where all Dr. Mahmoud Bahumian. So, wait! So, wait! No, 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 no. The minute you are a teacher, you are a teacher, you are a teacher. I cannot do you in the majority party, no, no, no. You are a few people who come to her. The pussy, the the foot, the chair that one, the table that we are in. Now we are coming. The pia, the ba, the jitana, the anko. Now we are coming. One is the leader of the party. One is the president of the Republic of Ghana, 2024. So what? You must have me. The number of women Ghana, in this year's party, we are leading the Shikuma. But so many here, here, now in Kori, they break eight years, man. So far, it's hard to cut the number of party women. They want to come here. We are not trying to get the carbon. We are not trying to get the carbon. It's a hard thing. We are not trying to get the carbon. One big party. You will come to her. We will not be so. We cannot put our situation in poverty. We cannot live in poverty. We cannot let the air poverty. That's the reality. The Zahami, the man who runs the country, is not a Muslim. The people who are not going to be able to get the air. The people who are not going to be able to get the air. The people who are not going to be able to get the air. The people who are not going to be on a pop president, that's your teacher, Mama. He's a good party man of the local president. Mami Naza, on the theater of Musabi Nation. Because Dr. Mahmoud Babumia, on your own Nation, Mama, and your Nation, Mama. Because on a million of the so, when you're pop para, on a million of the so, when you're truck driver, on a million of the so, when you're taxi driver, on a million of the so, when you're push up. So you put a demo, the pass will come. Now, number you in your wish account. Hey, hey, hey. Here, you have Number you in your yellow. Pass on the yellow. Come on, you to one. The man number you. So, today, the man of English, the man of English, I cannot avoid. When German speakers speak English, whether it's correct or it's right, it's correct. Get it? Today, we are going to we are going to learn the campaign. The 
Dr. Mamuru Baumia is launching campaign in the Northern Regional Capital of Germany. The campaign, Break the Egg. We are launching the campaign here to break the egg. Chobai! 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 So, and therefore, and therefore, I'm going to ask every one of you to be a campaign manager to make sure that His Excellency Dr. Mahmoud Bahumia will use me to break the eight years before I come to pass. Now, yes, we will. Thank you so much. Thank you. So,
Il est venu à la maison de la Mahama. Il est la maison de 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 la maison je ne sais pas si vous avez un peu de temps, mais vous avez un peu de temps. 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 Vous That your mama take it, your mama is here in the That is Shana, 56 billion. So, come to show, Mun of Sergana Nyanga, the government to show, Mun Targana Tony. When you buy him a visa on Masali, the Mabina Masao, visa to Mabia Masali, Mun Katiam Piggy, Mun Katiam Piggy, Mun Katiam Piggy. Pourquoi <laughs> Alaji Ali Mama, Sports Tetro, Banu Danangle, Bobby Gomez in Danangle, Andrew Tamar Palazaha, the man Latin and Mass, Street Life, Banu Danangle, Bobby Party in Danangle, Tisha Shell for a more, Jubilee Park, Banu Damale, Gomez, Bobby Party in Damale, Albuny Sambalwani, Anya Tamale in Tachi, Banu Mali, Bobby Party, Mali. Altamani Teaching Hospital. The Raja Ali Nore, the Raja Gomantima, the Rapala Nore Sali, the Ma Ibitam, March 2009, the Bara Pilt Tuma, the Rabom Nantini Tokara, Tirahi, was up on Nore, not at the Malashi Tuma. The Tamani Teaching Hospital, the Gomantin Rapala Nore Sali, the Raja Gomantini, the Raja, the March 2009.
the undisputed capital of Northern Ghana. And I begin by bringing you greetings from Damango constituency and greetings from the Savannah region, greetings from Gonjala. And they've asked me to tell you, the people of Northern region, that they are going to join you, join North East, join Upper West, join Upper East, and join all of Ghana to make Dr. Muhammad Dubawunia the next president of the Republic of Ghana. Tomorrow, my friends, on 4th August 1947 in Sopong, when our tradition, the UGCC, the greatest of all the traditions in Ghana and beyond, was established, the Northern People's Party was at its foundation. And that is why today we are here in Tamale to present to you the son of Tolona, the son of SD Dombo, the son of Jato Kalio, the son of Abaye Fakabo, the son of Arai Al Hassan, the son of Al Haji Ali Muhammad, the son of Mumuni Baumia, the next president of the Republic of Ghana. Tomoy, by the people of Tamale, and the people of Northern Region, it's important for me to submit that Dr. Muhammad Baumia is not being presented to the people of Ghana to be elected just because he's a Northerner. No, there are so many Northerners in Ghana and there are so many Northerners in the world. We present him because He's a man of integrity and honesty. When he was made the vice president, for us Northerners, the sadness used to call us the people of Pepe Pepe people, because we are honest people. And that is why we've come to be called Pepe people. And Dr. Baunia is an epitome, is a representation of the age-old value of Northern people, honesty, integrity. That is Dr. Baunia for you. And we present him not because he's a Northerner, not because he's a Mamprugu, not because he's a great son of Nagwewa, not because of that, not just because of that, but because he has shown that he's a competent Northerner, he's a hard-working Northerner, and he has a vision to transform this country. That is the man we brought to Tamale today. Next year we will get to the campaign, and there will be a lot for us to tell the people of Ghana. But let me conclude by telling one more thing. The NDC are claiming that it is eight years. Eight years, one party counts. Eight years, another party counts. If they want to know that the Wagubu is alive, they should come to Tamale tonight. And for me, I am fully fired up. And next year, in 2024, by the grace of God, Inshallah, Inshallah, by the grace of Almighty God, by the grace of Almighty God, Professor Kalmonia, the Savannah Regional Chairman is going to work with us for us to pin them down in Damangu. We will pin them down there. We will pin them down there. And we will overlap and make sure the Savannah Region becomes a battleground for the NDC. And as for Northern Region, I know you are going to vote massively for the MPP. And all of Ghana, and all of Ghana, and all of Ghana will then accept this humble man of integrity and honesty with vision and God willing on 7th January 2025. The good Lord will give us a perfect weather at the Blaster Square. Perfect weather at the Blaster Square. Perfect weather at the Blaster Square. And there he comes. There, we, there he will come. The great grandson of Nagwewa, Dr. Mahmoud Baumia will walk majestically to the Blaster Square.
who walk majestically to the Plaza Square, and Nana Adodanko Akufuado will hand over to him as President of the Republic of China. Thank you, Tamale. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, Tamale.
is the person God has ordained him to break the egg. May God bless you all. May God bless you. Love you so much. Love you. Love you. Love you. Chama, Rotome, Payan Tavayana. Chaman, 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 a long standing MP for the MPP in Parliament, who is now the majority leader all the way from Ashanti and Minister in charge of parliamentary affairs, Honorable Osanche Mesa Bansu. My brothers and sisters, let me just turn on the established protocol to tell you why your members of parliament all decided to follow the Excellency Mahmoud Baudia. You know, when we started this exercise, there were 10 people who put themselves up to contest the primaries. But almost all the members of parliament decided to support Dr. Mahmoud Baudia. Why? The response, the answer is simple. It is because even though all of them qualified to contest, they had the qualification and eligibility criteria, they would satisfy them. But beyond the qualification and eligibility, we needed one person who has demonstrable competence in the management of the economy. Now, where we are as a nation, our main problem is the economy. And of all of them, in the race, the person with the track record, the person with the knowledge, the person with the experience, the person with the competence, the person with the basket full of intelligence to deal with the economy for us is Dr. Mahmoud Dawuda. And that is why all of us decided to support him. Our brothers and sisters, Way back, way back in the formation of the United Party, when we all came together, the Northern People's Party, the original MPP, the Muslim Association Party, the NLM, the Gashi Fimwekwe, the Transporter People's Party, and Law Youth Association, when we all came together to form the United Party, the dominant party at the time was the original Northern People's Party, led by S.G. Dombo. At the time in Parliament, they commanded 13 seats. NLM and the Ghana Congress Party had five seats. S.G. Dombo it was, who made the greatest sacrifice. As a position leader, he surrendered to Professor K. A. Buzir. And then, when Guzia was chased out of the country into exile, Edi Dombo became the acting opposition leader. And then, as you do know, Guzia, when he traveled out, of course, he continued his politics. And when Nkuma was overthrown and he came back, because of the name that he has established for himself, he then, became, he then came to form the Progress Party, which won election for us, and Guzia became the Prime Minister. If S.G. Dombo had not made a big sacrifice for Busia, Busia could not have come back to become the, president, the Prime Minister of this country. Busia, it was who held the hand of President Kufuor at 29 years old and made him the Deputy Foreign Affairs Minister. It was on that platform that Kufuor launched himself in 1996 to lead this party. So if Busia and not also become the Prime Minister. Kufu could have become the, the president of this country. And from Kufu, then we have Abu Fuadu. Abu Fuadu came and built his own image on the achievement of President Kufu. So you see, it was just one big sacrifice of Edi Dobu, which made us, which made it possible for our tradition 
to go and occupy the seat of government. Today, we have, we have a veritable son of the North who has, as I've said, the competence, the track record. He's been just a vice president in the shadow of the president. And yet we all know the programs and projects that he has championed as just the vice president, which has yielded good dividends for us as a country. Much more if he becomes the president of this country. And that's why we have so much belief in him. In Baumia, we have tremendous belief that with him, this country will experience a turn around. He is the one with the key. He is the one with the key to reposition this country. That's why all of us are following him. So police, we have seen the marriage in Dr. Baumia. We have come together from the south, from Ashanti, from Greater Agra, from Eastern Region, from Puno, from Ahafo, from all over to produce for you Dr. Mahmoud Dovia. I would have believed in you that Inshallah, that Inshallah, with your hard work to complement what he is going to initiate for us, God in his own appointed time is going to put him at Jubilee House and you will see our children, our youth today, our children and our children's children, the benefits that we receive from the administration of Dr. Mahmoud Gaumia. My brothers and sisters, this is the reason why we are here. So late in the evening and I am overwhelmed by the affection that you have shown. Please let us translate this into victory for him and for MPP in December 2024, so that the goodness in him, in Dr. Baumia, will become manifest to the MPP, to the Northern Region, to Northeast, to Savannah, to Upper East, to Upper West, to Bulo, to Ahafo, to Bulo East, to Ashanti, to Eastern Region, Central Region, Western North, Western Region, Greater OT, and Volta. Let us stand together as one nation, with one people, with a common destiny. God bless all of you. God bless all of you. And let's stand shoulder to shoulder with Dr. Mahmoud Baudia, because the way for us is eternal glory for the good people of this country. God bless you all. Former national youth organizer, former national organizer of the MPP, current director general, national youth police authority, support of Supremo, Kenya youth, Honorable Sami Abudu. Then I saw the overhead, the overpass. The first morning interchange. Thanks to your brother and the Ekufuado government, we are going to have one in Tamale. Dr. Baumia, together with his colleagues in government, also fought for Agenda 111. Over seven districts in the northern region are going to have hospitals of their own. When he thought of providing these banks to our farmers, our brother's party said the dams will bring mosquitoes. Any good thing coming the way of the north. Some of our people will kick against it. In 2024, it's not going to be an election of NDC year, MPP year.
It's going to be an election between competence and incompetence. There's an election on the ballot paper between hope and hopelessness. There's an election between the future and the past. In Dr. Baumia, we have hope. In Dr. Baumia, we have a future. And in Dr. Baumia, we have prosperity and jobs for the youth of them. And I keep saying, follow who no road. Somebody became assemblyman. From assemblyman to MP. From MP to deputy minister. From deputy minister to minister. From minister to vice president. And from vice president to president. From president to former president. Interchange. We didn't see hospitals. We didn't see free education. We didn't see one village, one down. But why? You chop all these posts apart from UN Secretary General that you no chop. Give the opportunity to somebody who has become vice president for just two times and has brought transformation to the people of Ghana. The majority leader has said it all. Your brother has made you proud in the South. And that is why when you look at the vote that he done it, across the entire country, he mobilized enough votes to make you proud. I want to bring with you the 2024 election the campaign has started. All of you are campaign managers. All of you must own the campaign. And all of you must take the campaign to the doorstep of our opponent. And inshallah, I was telling our friends in Nalerugu that my Quranic verse that I don't joke with is Holy Quran chapter 13 verse 11. He said, verily, verily, Allah will not change the condition of a group of people until they change it themselves. So meaning, Allah will bless whatever you are doing if you take the first step. Today we are taking the first step as a party. And it's up to all of us to take the second step and Allah will bless us. And I know that when we started, First, the NDC said the northern region was their war back. First, we didn't have Savannah, we didn't have Northeast. There were a total of 31 seats. We only have four. Thanks to Dr. Bamia. Now we have 16. NDC have 15. He has moved us from four to 16. NDC, they have dropped from 27 to 15. So in 2024, this year World Bank will become a microfinance. Assalamu alaikum. Bye, I'm talking to you now. Bye. I will not go. I'm going to join the ruler of Northern Music. First thing.
Tanya Sulu, Tanya Sulu, Tanya Hello, Joboy! 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 Hey, now they have to show you. Now I'm going to book out. Bring Shai Yen in 2024. Tinashi Nya, Gana Pune, Tum Break 8. Tinashi Nya, Gana Pune, Present Nulu, Gana Nulu, Gana Nulu, Present Alma. Umbuar Men Umbuaya. Yabu, Wabu, Eni Sinu, Nya, Nubu, Kanem, Nubu, Tilabu, Jima. Anabi Isanda, Chama, Owa, Labna. Why not in Lavana and this could do Lavana? So, I'm wondering here and come on. Breaking the eighth man, now you can see I'm breaking the man. So, I'm pulling a pump, cup high, now I'm not here at Barca. Tomoy, Tomoy, she might put out of my pay of the bread, not of my yard, and the little bit. The incoming president of the Republic of Canada, the master economist, the competent vice president, the competent leader, Isha Allah, coming to break the end. Isha Allah, Isha Allah, I invite. The national chairman of the MPP, Taimasu, Taimasu. Black bearer of the new patriotic party as you have elected him for the new patriotic party. So I'm going to invite His Excellency the Vice President Al Haji Mahamudu Baumia and the incoming president Chairman, Ministers of State, Members of Parliament, Regional Chairman, Regional Executives, Constituency Chairman, the Constituency Executives, Mabihi, Anungula, Tudagayi, Mituma Tuma, Aizongula, Mabanyasam Kam, Mampana Yungo, Kinajia, Yema Awawa Tungo, who here come out, Uncle Layam, Mama, who here from the pie? Candida Zoo, the Italian Yella, Zook Social Tinya, November 4th, MPP, Flag Bearer Election Man. The Ranya Zook Song, and Yere Uncle Ankara, they can see Zook Sumana, Uncle Yah. That's what I'm saying. Just so I'm on the way. This is what I'm gonna use. Zoom up. Then this is the summer. This is what I'm saying. Can you hear me? Zoom up and I'm gonna hear it. Dama, the election 2024. Be with me. Election 2024. Man, 
Zumomo, John Mahama is going around the whole country and promising everything to everybody. It is as if he has never been president in this country before. Kalala! It is as if he has never been president. It is as if he has just landed from Mars. When you were president, did he create jobs? No. Did he tackle corruption? No. Did he issue the Ghana card? No. Did he bring mobile money into our probability? No. Did he bring the Ghana digital property address system? Did he bring the Zongo development fund? Did he bring the teacher training allowances back? Did he bring free Wi-Fi to schools? Did he bring paperless ports? Did he bring gold for oil? Did he bring free SHS? Did he bring free TVET for our schools? All of these problems he couldn't solve. It was the MPP government under Nana Kupuado who solved those problems. Today, he is trying to come back. Before he told us he was a dead goat, isn't it? Brian Ongela Bukim Kalala. The Bukum Bola Ula Yafsi. Eh, Olato Yafsi. No, the dead goat cannot be revived. He has been president before and he couldn't solve our problem. Even me, as vice president, I have solved many problems. I have been able to guide the issuing of the Ghana card. One constituency, one ambulance. Agenda 111. Zip line drones. Mobile money interoperability. Gold for oil. Free Wi Fi in schools. Today, with your mobile phone, you can renew your national health insurance card. You can buy electricity credit. We have brought paperless ports. What idea did your Mahama bring when he was vice president? What idea? What, what idea did he bring as vice president? He did not bring even one idea to the table. And I challenge anybody to tell us one idea that Dr. John Mahaman brought. Dr. Baumia has brought idea after idea after idea after idea. It tells you that if you make me president, I will have my own vision and I will have my own priority and I will bring more ideas and more ideas and more ideas. Today, John Mahama says he has a new idea. And what is the new idea? He says he wants a 24-hour economy. 24-hour economy. He doesn't even understand that policy. Today in Ghana, our hospitals work 24 hours. Our electricity company works 24 hours. Our water company works 24 hours. Our phone companies work 24 hours. Many job bars work 24 hours. Isn't it? Today, because of digitalization, the banks you can transfer money 24 hours. You can receive money 24 hours. Isn't it? So he doesn't understand his own policy. It does not make sense. And I want you to vote in 2024 for Dr. Mahmoud Baumia. I will bring a new vision. I will bring new policies.
and we will transform this country. John Mahama is the past. John Jatapalumia is the future. If John Mahama was there, we would still be having a Jumso economy. You can't have 24 hour economy with Jumso. So you want to vote for Dr. Baumia in 2024. We will take the country to new heights. Puya Pam Kapai. Salamu alaikum. Puma Makulai. Salamu alaikum. Puma alaikum salam. The incoming president. Puya Pam Kuti Baya to Puya Pam Kapai. Now we are so good. We are very grateful for your excellence in the president.